Hello everybody, welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. Grid Legends is here on the channel of Grid Legend coming out. So we're gonna be doing a first impression here in the beginning, rookie season circuit or rookie season circuit race. And we're just gonna be getting our feet wet, trying to see how the wheel feels without any tuning or anything like that. So make sure you follow me on all social media, all from the description box below. Let's get to it. Definitely like the fact that I see some GTIs and some Audis. Looks like we are in a TCR race. Looks like we get to drive in an Audi. So first. Okay, that's aimed to place in front of Vega. He's been having some good races recently. So, first impressions is it's actually kind of uh, interesting feedback off the rip, especially something you expect from an arcade style game. I feel like I need to be in a different view. Oh, we got a little bit further view. Like, I lost it. Oh, come on. I was trying to change views. So, first person view is definitely how I love racing of course oh but the wheel doesn't turn it's like Forza that might be something we can change in settings except this is just no change no settings just kind of right into a race and I feel like outside camera is probably going to be the funnest camera to drive so first okay, impressions of the wheel, it it's does feel, oh, feel pretty good. Definitely a lot stiffer than I expected it to be, but we are in a brand new setting. So 100% feedback. Oh, we lost a little bit there. I can feel it. I can feel the, the move break of traction, actually. But we do need to get rid of this racing line and everything like that. Let's see if we can do that real quick. Options, gameplay. Ooh, visual only or full damage? We do visual only right now. And difficulty hard. Ah, we'll leave it hard on for right now. Manual, okay. Sequential with clutch. Manual sequential, that's what this one is. Clutch override enabled. Racing line off. That's what we want. We'll leave all of that stuff right now trash control and stability control and everything just to kind of get our feet wet in this game so now we should have manual trans with a clutch override and of course no racing line because racing line is for new people So I believe from what I heard you have to pay appreciate damage in this game. So we definitely don't want to wreck our car too too bad if we have it on full. As as I say that we just smack into the back of this guy. Alright, one lap left. Keep your position ahead of Vega. That guy just died. So we just gotta keep ahead of who we're already ahead of. Definitely had a lot of fun on the other grid games. Definitely did a lot of fun with drifting and stuff like that. And this game seems to be, it's going to be a lot of fun as well. Trying to use the course map to tell myself where I'm at. May have to go in there and fine tune the force feedback, but overall the wheel does feel pretty good off the rip. It definitely does not feel super arcadey. Try and take this pass. Take a second place. I'll take a second place in the first race. I will take second place in that Audi TCR. So definitely, like I'm excited to say, Grid Legends here on the channel. Definitely a 
big change of pace, but you know, of course I got beat by GTI. I wish I would have been in that GTI. But we did take second. So my name is Rookie. Driver 22. Right, nice driving today. I'll be shocked if it didn't catch Addo's eye. What a race. Some Event unlocked today. earned Any race. Driver difficulty experience. Okay, okay. Getting a lot of experience there. Finish ahead. Okay, finish ahead of Vega. That's all we need to do to complete that challenge. All right, I'll take it. So, back in the original grids, I had a lot of fun doing drifting and stuff like that in the games, and the racing was just super fun. It's definitely a way to throw back and have a little fun. Now, are we bumped into open wheel? I mean, finish eighth or higher. All right, we're just going full send into this right now. Little open wheel at night. Try not wreck our car too bad. You heard that right. Marcus Ado is looking for a teammate for you, mate. Seems like they've run out of options. This could be your break. You've got nothing to lose. Give it your best shot. Got nothing to lose except an entire car. Oh, that. That was a bit rough. So I do notice a difference from being in that touring car to this car. So there is a different feel of the wheel. We're trying to move our way up. We gotta finish eighth or higher. And three laps should not be too hard. We may have to bump this AI difficulty up a little bit. Cockpit. Oh, this little bump. Okay, two more laps. You're in a good position. Try and stick with it. Ooh, <laughs> I almost lost that. Oh, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Go back into. To me, this, oh, to me this feels like a game you would play in third person for right now. I do like the graphics look amazing. The sounds are great. I don't know why I just bumped him open. If I had damage on full, I probably would have snapped my wheel already. We may have to try the next one in damage full and see how this works. Not knowing these courses is definitely uh, feel a hindrance, but try right, crossover. So overall, first impressions of this, it's definitely uh, feels very, very stiff and very nice on my fan attack. I could probably turn the feedback down. Oh, probably turn the feedback down on the wheel a little bit. But I want to get into some other race cars and see how it fully feels before I fully fine tune my feedback. Oh no! What? Is there a rewind button? Ah, uh, I pulled the Forza Horizon Rewind. I can't believe that guy just died in the front. Yep, we did it. We pulled the rewind. And we're pulling the whole Forza Passing. I feel like I'm playing Forza Horizon right now, but we're going to take the win there. So I mean, Five. I'll take it. Honestly, I don't think there's any way Ado could ignore your performance today. I've got a feeling you'll be having some very interesting discussions. Congratulations. Well, I'm sure I mean, I'm still a uh, just player. I'm nobody uh, like named right now. We may have to go back and redo this, but actually put our name in. So definitely 
interested to see all the different cars and all the different types of racing and things like that here in this game. I think this is just the beginning. What is this? And Seneca continued to have trouble during testing with multiple drivers involved in on-track incidents. Um, no mistakes this time. Is he shift locking? Hmm. Run it again, but with less throttle. I feel like he was shift locking. Check, check. This is Ajit, lead engineer. We've had a few bad days with the test drivers and I still need help with the setup, so give me a few laps and please bring the car back intact. Okay. I feel like I could do uh I could do just that. I think. Let's see what this car can do. Push it. I mean, okay, 22. For the first race of the series, we'll need you to keep up with you, mate. So while you're getting data for a Jeep, just get a feel for the car. I mean, the car is grippy. I'll tell you that already. Off racing line, though. Try a corner with a touch of handbrake. I'd like to see you control the slide. Oh! He told me to drift, so we're doing it. Nope. <laughs> a little clutch kick? We're trying to drift the race car? I don't think that's the right idea. Gear shift points. So if we get a perfect gear shift, I'm assuming. Let's see if we can hit top speed in this section. I mean, I can't go any time. faster. Let's see if we can find any more pace. Oh, we're dead. Accidents happen, but in a race scenario, mistakes will cost you places. Well, duh. So, for first impressions of the game, definitely going to have a lot of fun playing this game. So if you guys want to keep seeing Good Legend here on the channel, let me know down in the comment section down below. If you guys are playing it, let me know what you find okay, is the best is settings the for you, because right now, oh, I'm not paying attention to the track. One thing having to get used to me would be all the different tracks. System though. Why? Why'd you break it? Try and not go off course on the final lap. Great work. Addo did say you were good. He wasn't wrong. That's yeah, better. We didn't go off course this time. Kind of stayed in the racing line. I'm trying to run apex on these turns, but I can't really. Great to practice a power slide. I don't want to practice power slides in a race car. I mean, I do, but I don't. This doesn't really work that well. So I think that's gonna do it here for this episode here on Grid Legends. Definitely fun to have another game on the roster of things to bring out to you guys. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll the description box below. As always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.